Opa! <risos> I'm going to show you what fighting really is. In order to get a successful tower dive, you need to learn to control the damage that you will be taking and also to use your environment. Now let me give you an example. Angela is already using her second skill on Grog, so he's not going anywhere. And the stepping outside the tower will be the best option at the moment. That would only trigger the damage that we will be taking from the tower. So this is the plan. Now that Grog is trapped in the second skill, we can go inside and claim our kill. <laughs> he's not going anywhere. Now, we gotta quickly step outside the tower because someone is joining already. And right now I don't have the skill to fight him. So it will be a complete suicide. Keeping my distance from him would allow me to survive more. Because as you can see, I'm also low HP. <laughs> but look at that. He already used his ultimate. Now our chances of dying just decreased. Thank you, Nana. <laughs> now, let's go for the next one. If you remember, this is all about tower dive. So I already have a plan. We're gonna be using the first skill so like that we can position her in this direction because this is the place we want her to die and then we're gonna proceed to use the second skill so like that we can cross the wall also catch her and at the same time position her on the way we want Ooh, someone wants to join too maybe believes he's the main character <laughs> now i already have a contingency plan for her but she doesn't know that so we're gonna proceed to show aggressiveness inside the tower and right after she's confident because of the tower damage we're going to be using the second skill and then we're gonna be freezing ourselves because if you remember Untum was really kind to upgrade this item and now you can freeze yourself while using the skills fun fact I already knew that this was not going to be a fair match so I made my minimap smaller so like that they will have the advantage on vision <laughs> I'm a little crazy. 